YSL New Slim Lipstick. I recommend two colours. One is a 302, one is a 301. Uh, I said it before, I, I think I said it in a few videos a few months back that I never really tried the YSL lipstick before and the two I bought which is kind of disappointing but this time oh I highly highly recommend the black slim one it is a semi matte if any YSL fans knows that they have the gold uh, slim lipstick that one is a full matte the other one which is a pink uh, slim one that is more uh, hydrating more dewy finish and this black slim lipstick is more towards it's more in the middle it's like a semi matte it's very creamy natural finish let's do the uh, uh, 302 first I recommend two color is very easy to remember 302 301 How beautiful it is it's like a smoky red it has lovely level of brownness in there and it's so smooth this time I really really like their formulation and the thing about if you do a thin layer it looks very very soft very very nice when you lay it up it's very elegant it's so nice today again we're going to do a thin layer as well as a thick layer they created 302 this color so well there are so many red brown lipstick colors out there but this one is oh, I don't know how to describe uh, normally the brown red type of lipstick is very much easier to make it towards like a little bit grayish so cam looks a little bit you know towards more mature side look at this time I think well, I don't know how to describe I think this time they add a very very good level of brownness as well as a little bit of nice petal color made it made it like not too much gray in a way so it's everyone wearable and suits everyone so this is just a thin layer so comfortable to wear very creamy very hydrating you know today I didn't oh, why well, shoot well I didn't get chance to remove the dead skin on my lip but you guys see I have a little bit dead skin Ooh. by the way it's a thunderstorm outside so yeah if you guys see over here a little bit I do still have a little bit dry skin but it doesn't impact the performance of this lipstick I'm so impressed with YSL this time and let's do a thick layer this is the second layer you darken the color <laughs> Oh my god how delicious it is oh this is really really nice once you layer it up it really shows the full personality of this color it adds more brownness in there but it it's also merges even better with the redness it reduces the petal color when you do the thin layer it's more towards petal rosy very soft that type of style but the ones you layer it up oh my god your style is being carried so this color would be very much suitable for whoever 
once a day makeup transfer into evening one if you go for events you know after work or you you know go somewhere for a drink afterwards you really want to just lift up your makeup you really no need to do any other touch up just do a second layer of this one remember guys 302 302 okay um, I do use uh, foundation to cover uh, the my lip color although my lip color is not that dark anyway but it's just to show the true color of the lipstick but this collection is very very good pigmentation even a thin layer can really much cover your own lip color if you feel 302 is a little bit too powerful sometime recommend 301 this is more nude color but very beautiful nude oh, guys you have to see how creamy this one is do you see how creamy this lipstick is so this is 301 it's more towards nude the color is still very rich in a way but it's less powerful as 302 and see how easy to be blended out isn't it do you see how beautiful this one is? Compare this one with 302. You can straight away this one to soften you down. It doesn't matter, you know, how aggressive sometimes you can be or when you are angry. But when you wear this, oh, it, when you when you look at yourself in front of the mirror, you will calm yourself down that's how i would describe this color it's really calming softening softening the edge that type of color it's very very beautiful then let's do a second layer Even you layer it up, it doesn't impact the sole of this color. <laughs> I think the sole of this color is soft, elegant, very lady. So a thin layer, thick layer, both carries the same sole. It just depends on your own makeup. If you have no makeup, I would do a thin layer. If you have just light makeup or even a little bit stronger makeup, I would do a second layer. Oh, this one is so pretty at the end let me just put those two color together so for you guys to see the difference as well uh, and also this time is the same design as the gold uh, slim lipstick it is very easy to draw your lip lines as well I never used the gold uh, slim lipstick for YSL but I find them. I don't need to try anyone else. So this is 302. This is a 301. So this is more 302. The soul of 302. It is more rich and powerful and more. If you want to add a little bit matureness there, it is sexy. That's a 302. If you feel 302 is a little bit too towards brown or a little bit too rich for your liking highly recommend 301 301 the sole is lady soft and elegant you literally carry your style out both color are very very nice for wearing thin layer as well as a thick layer this two if you are looking for colors from this um, collection i certainly recommend start from this two colors 
for this formulation in terms of the performance, the experience of applying it, the long lasting wise as well. Uh, it is like a semi matte finish, therefore it's not last that long, but longer than the normal creamy lipstick. Uh, the performance itself, the pigmentation, the formulation are very, very good. The only thing I think if you do have a lot of lip lines or deep lip lines, this one doesn't emphasize it, but same time doesn't visually smoothen it out. So that's something to bear in mind. Other than that, very good collection from YSL. So if you haven't tried it and interested, they are worth it. Start with the color 301 or 302. And I will see you on my next video.